The Summit Street Improvement Project includes the addition of two roundabouts. Statistics show that in the 17 months since the first roundabout opened, the number of reported crashes at the intersection has decreased by 80%. The newest roundabout at the intersection of Campus Center Drive and Risman Drive has multiple lanes and Hawk beacons. Hawk stands for High Intensity Activated Crosswalk and is a traffic control device used to make it safer for pedestrians to cross the street in high traffic areas. Here are some simple rules to remember about the Hawk Beacon at the roundabout. The beacon consists of three lights, a yellow light at the bottom and two red lights at the top. The beacon will only come on when a pedestrian presses the button. Otherwise, the beacon will remain dark with no light showing. When the beacon is dark, motorists should proceed through the roundabout as usual, yielding to traffic already in the circle and pedestrians already in the crosswalk. If the Hawk Beacon is flashing yellow, that means a pedestrian has pushed the button and vehicles should slow down. Motorists can still proceed through the crosswalk but should do so with caution. When the beacon turns solid yellow, that means be prepared to stop. When the light is red, motorists must stop and allow pedestrians to cross. When the beacon is flashing red, vehicles must stop but can proceed through the crosswalk once it's clear. Remember, flashing yellow means slow down, Solid yellow means get ready to stop. And red means stop. Flashing red means stop, but you can proceed when the crosswalk is clear. The Hawk Beacon can be used by the visually impaired to safely cross the street at the roundabout and can also assist other pedestrians during periods of high traffic volume. When a pedestrian approaches the crosswalk, the pedestrian signal will be dark. If there is not an available gap in traffic to cross or if the person has a visual impairment, they should press the button. The pedestrian signal will indicate when it is safe to cross. Keep in mind that the beacon only stops one direction of traffic at a time. When a pedestrian reaches the median, they can press another button to safely cross to the other side of the road. Follow these simple guidelines and you will find navigating the newest roundabout easier than you think.